Hi friends, it's Nikki here from Gabby Lime Plans. Oh, this week's video I've got, I'm so excited. I bought the new planner, the 18 month planner from PNA. Got it today, couldn't wait, had to film it straight away. So I just thought I'd give you guys a flip through and then you can see um, why I'm so excited. So the first thing is it's an 18 month planner. So it goes from August, 2020 to January, 2022. And I have the information page that I took off the back here. Um, so if you want to just pause the video and you can have a read of what all you get but I'm going to give you quite a good flip through right now the one thing I must say is that it's um it's such a nice size and it's it's so chunky and I just I don't know about you but I love a chunky planner so it's very very pretty um it's got copper copper binding um the spiral binding or the coil binding and then it's I don't know if the camera's picking it up so well but it's got copper foiling in the wording and the hummingbird and in the flowers on the back it's got the same design but it without the foiling so it's but it's and it's got a lovely elastic closure and it's it's really really pretty even before you get in it's the first thing that caught my eye um was the uh, copper foiling so i just you know i had to have it so let's just open it up so the first page is your um, introduction page or your name page. This planner belongs to. Just to give you some quick ideas of the measurements here. Um, in inches, you're looking at about seven inches uh, by just under nine and a half inches. In centimeters, we're looking at 18 centimeters by 23 and a half centimeters. So, I would say it's a B5. In South Africa, we don't really have B5. So for my South African subscribers or viewers, uh, it's bigger than an A5, it's smaller than an A4. It's actually for me the perfect size. So carrying on, so we have public holidays here for 2021. The nice thing is with this planner, it's a Southern Hemisphere and a Northern Hemisphere uh, planner. And it's aimed for uh, people in the USA and Canada and the UK, as well as uh, South Africa, Australia and New Zealand. So it's got all of the public holidays here. Moving on, you've got your full year at a glance of 2021 and then you give you 2022 as well. And then we get straight into August. Now, I have to tell you, this planner is beautiful. I love color. I love pretty planners and um I couldn't resist I, I just I had to have it and the, I love the fact that we're starting in South Africa to bring out 18 month planners because it's not something that we really have done until now so what the nice thing is is that you've got your August page here planning and priorities so you can put your monthly goals you can put your monthly to-do list your task list any notes here the best time for new beginnings is now it's very pretty it's the greens and the it's very um the whole planner is very muted colors, but very colorful at the same time, which is really my style. A very nice monthly, um, very nice size boxes. And then you've got your to-do list down the side here. And then you get into your weeklies. The weeklies, um, you have uh, two a vertical weekly with two boxes. So it's not like the Happy Planner with the three boxes, but they're, they're bigger boxes than the Happy Planner. This is sized the same size as the Classic Happy Planner. So for those of you who have a Classic Planner or Classic Happy Planner, sorry, and know that size, this is exactly the same size as a Classic Happy Planner. Um, you have a new quote every single week. You have your monthly, that your current month um, uh, at a glance over here, a to-do and notes box, and the design carries through from, you know, for the whole month, which is very pretty. Okay, so I'm going to flip through to the dividers for every month now. So here we have September. Oh, I love these colors. I really love these colors. Plan for tomorrow, celebrate today. I mean, really, it's beautiful. There's your monthly, there's your weekly. I mean, oh, just these colors. I'm going to, I'm sorry, I'm really excited about this planner and I'm probably going to gush through the whole video. But, you know, that's just the way it is. I just love these things, pretty things and things that I can plan in and things that I can put stickers in and just oh I love it I love it so October this one is one of my favorite dividers look at these little foxes aren't they gorgeous if the plan doesn't work don't change oh change the plan but never the goal that is so true never heard that one before but it's very very true change your plan but never change your goal so there's the monthly and then on the weekly you've got that fox look at that fox it's so cute 
I have to tell you this paper is gorgeous it's not thin paper I was actually expecting it to be quite thin paper it's not and I do believe that um, it's on par with happy planner paper um, I'm not sure of the other kind of paper uh, I, I would have to say it's about 100 110 GSM I'm not sure what um, weight that is in pounds um, in South Africa we work with the GSM um, printer paper is 80 GSM and I would say this is I would say this is about 100 GSM and I do think it will take my uniball signal uh, very well I don't think it's going to ghost um, and I think that yeah you generally your your ink pens and your microns and things I think you're going to work very well with it so let's carry on November I have to tell you the one thing with this is that it is geared seasonally for the northern hemisphere now I don't have a problem with that um, I really I really don't mind um, I love the colors I love everything about this planner but if something that if it's something that's going to bother you being in South Africa or in the southern hemisphere then obviously don't get this planner um, because it is very seasonally geared towards the northern hemisphere so you've got in November your your autumn pages give thanks obviously Thanksgiving in the States which I think is a, a lovely day to celebrate anyway when no matter where you are Here's our monthly, and oh, look at those colors. Isn't that beautiful? Absolutely beautiful. Love it. December, yay, happiness is homemade. Oh, yes. And it's it's just gorgeous. Look at that. Really pretty, the reds and the greens. But, like, not bright, you know, it's not in your face. Bright pops of color. It's just, it's so subtle and but it satisfies my need for color. Oh, look at these little squirrels are gorgeous. And the Christmas decoration and the berries. Sorry, I'm gushing again, but oh my gosh. It is so pretty. Check the quote. Life is short. Do stuff that matters. Oh, yes. Here we go to January. A snow page. Oh, I wish we had snow in South Africa. We do have snow in South Africa, but not everywhere. Um, it's only on the mountains, really, and in the Drakensberg. Every now and again, every 10 years, we have a bit of snow in Joburg but uh, this winter it didn't happen so that's very pretty i love the colors oh it's lovely isn't that lovely february the month of love but it's not cutesy you know it's pretty it's really pretty but it's not sort of kitsch if i can say it like that very nice very muted colors the pink is gorgeous oh it's lovely very pretty. I'm going to say lovely a lot because there's only so many words that you can say. Beautiful, lovely, pretty, cute. Okay. Ah, oh, umbrellas. I would so use these umbrellas. You know that if I had these umbrellas in every one of these designs, I would use them. I would use them even if it wasn't raining because they are just so pretty. So let's look at the month. And oh, I love these colors. I love these colors. Oh my gosh. Lovely. April. Be awesome every day. Yeah, we should be awesome every day. Look at that little butterflies. And monthly. The colors are beautiful. I mean, this blue, it's like a um, like a periwinkle blue, maybe. And the peach, and it's just, it's so, so pretty. I'm sorry, I can't say anything more about that. And then my birthday month. Yay, and they've made it so pretty. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. I love it. Look at it, look at it. Little bird houses. Oh, I love it, the teal and the pink, and thank you so much for making my birthday pretty planner makers, because usually May is just kind of a nothing month in the planner world, and they don't get such pretty, you know, dividers and things, so I'm really chuffed, I'm like, I'm seriously like, happy, I'm really, I mean, this to me is like worth the whole planner, even though I love the whole planner, so let's, oh, look at that, isn't that pretty, oh, it's gorgeous, oh, I love it love it thank you so much there's june oh yes it's also very pretty look the flamingos so pretty and you know what i like these summery colors in winter for south for, for joburg in winter is very dreary let me tell you we don't have snow we have like no grass we have no trees it's all bare and we have no rain and it's just really dull so yeah i want my planet to look pretty so give me summer Summer planner in winter for me is very, very, very nice. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at that. July. 
take time to enjoy the beauty of today. Look, I love that. I love that with the black background. It makes everything just pop. So, so pretty. Oh, yes. I love those colors. <laughs> I really get excited about this stuff. Oh, yes. August. Very nice. It's very, very pretty. Don't count the days. Make the days count. It's actually very, very true. It's an old saying, but it's a good one. Here's the monthly. Oh, I love that with the different greens. Very, very nice. September. Oh, look at that. I love that. I love autumn colors. I am an autumn color girl. A lot of reds and oranges and it's sort of those kind of colors in my house. And, and, and that's just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Oh, yes. Very pretty. October. It's nice. I love that. It's got like this pop of little lilac in it. It's really, really pretty. I can't say pretty enough, hey? Seriously. Let's get myself a thesaurus, maybe. And <laughs> get some different words to use. Oh, yeah. That's very nice. I love that. That's also lovely. That's a nice quote. Be thankful for what you are now and keep fighting for what you want to be tomorrow. Oh, yes. Thank you very much. I will take that. That's lovely. Here's December. Oh, I love Christmas. Oh, I love Christmas. It's the most wonderful time of the year. It really is. Like the holly berries. Oh, gosh, look at that. Oh, it's beautiful. And again, it's not kitschy, you know. It's, it's, it's very pretty. It's just very... Classy, I think. Oh, I'm going to say classy. Oh, wow. Look at that. For January 2022, the start of something new brings the hope of something great. It's gorgeous. You just don't expect this blue in the middle of all these autumn colors. And it's lovely. It's so fresh. It's just what you need for a new year, right? Happiness isn't a destination. It's a way of life. It's lovely. So what I like about this planner is that you actually get a note section which is really nice so it's built in very pretty divider and you get some note pages only a few but what i'm actually going to do is i'm going to take the information page and i'm going to use it as a template and i'm going to use my single hole punch and i'm going to punch um, holes in paper and then you just cut slits and then you pop them into your spiral so if you guys want to see me do that um, I'm happy to do a, a video on that just leave a comment down below about that so that's a few note pages and you get a folder which is lovely and it's a three pocket folder so you get this side you get the top and then you get on this side of the page you get the back and that's it I'm going to be putting my happy planner pen loop over there to put my in a ball in which is perfect and then uh, that's it put the strap back around oh i am so excited i'm literally going to sit this evening and just going to put all my dates in and my plans and yeah and that's it so if you guys would like an update of this um in a, in a couple of weeks time see how i'm using it and see how functional it is as well as pretty also please leave a comment down below i'll be happy to do that and yeah if you like this uh, please give me a like and if you uh, like the video please consider subscribing and i'll see you again next week bye